year ago, the Miss Universe pageant was held in Perth, in Western Australia. We felt very fortunate that we were able to have with us that night a musical superstar, Donny Osmond. I guess we're on a lucky streak because we have him with us again tonight. Please welcome the great Donny Osmond. I hope the looks don't deceive. I ain't got time for two dimensions. Got to make the move right now. Got to meet that girl somehow. Get it right the first time. That's the main thing. Right the first time, that's the main thing. Can't afford to let it pass. Get it right the next time. That's not the same thing. Right the next time, that's oh, not the same thing. Gonna make the first time last. Thank you very much. Kamsa Hamida. Thank you very much. Now, ladies and gentlemen, a very pleasant duty for me. I'm going to introduce our distinguished panel of judges. And I'm especially pleased about this assignment because, well, I've seen the effort and dedication that these judges have put forth. They, um, they realize the importance of their decision to these lovely young women. And they act accordingly. So here now is our panel. First of all, the star of numerous motion pictures, winner of the Theatre World Award, and an Emmy nominee for television's very successful Route 66, George Meharis. All right. The chairman of the board of the Korean Community School Association and of the Language Teaching Foundation right here in Seoul, Che Kyung Oh. From the, uh, the world of sports, one of the bright young stars of the National Hockey League, from the New York Rangers, Ron Duguay. <laughs> President of the Press Association of Spain and of the Federation of Press Associations, as well as a distinguished author, Louise Maria Anson. A former city editor of one of the world's leading newspapers, and now the distinguished president of the, of the Asahi Broadcasting Corporation of Japan, Kyoshi Hara. <laughs> Beauty expert, business leader, author, and head of the world's largest model agency, Eileen Ford.
The uh, distinguished artist whose works have been seen in the finest museums, as well as on the covers of international magazines and in major motion pictures. The watercolorist, Dong Kingman. A scholar and diplomat who has served Korea as both an ambassador and as a member of the National Assembly, Ilyong Jung. Now, uh, two years ago, when the pageant was held in Mexico, our next judge was chosen Miss Universe. Please welcome Margaret Gardner. An actor with wide experience in both motion pictures and in television, known to audiences everywhere for his portrayal of the superhero John Shaft. And he's starring in the soon-to-be-released film Inchon. Richard Roundtree. An accomplished musician and television executive whose company hosted last year's Miss Universe pageant in Perth, Australia. Max Bostock. Now, the world's most widely read columnist, whose Dear Abby columns appear in over a, a thousand different newspapers all around the world, including the Korea Times right here in Seoul. Abigail Van Buren. Thank you, judges. And thank you, Donnie. Come, sa Hamida. Yes, every bit of it. The farmer's dance is the most popular of all Korean folk dances. It's a traditional dance of thanksgiving. And we are thankful that you will now be able to see this colorful and exciting dance performed by the world-famous Korean National Dance Company.